Hey everybody, welcome back to the Old Sweets Farm. It's Rich. I want to do a product review. This one's total impromptu product review. It came up kind of out of the blue. As you know, we've got our big barn, we got uh, two big feeders, we've got a lot of birds, some food gets spilled, and with that in the barn, we get mice. Um, I'm going to say this year, there's a lot more mice than in the past. Uh, you'll see them scurrying along the, the walls. The girls do catch their share of mice. Uh, I'm surprised how good a hunter they are. But I'm tired of mice. And we have tried just about everything. We've tried sticky traps. We have tried little traps that go in tunnels. Uh, we have tried traditional traps. You know, the wood ones with the little metal thing that snaps on them. Nothing seems to work long, long term or work consistently. We're out at the hardware store the other night and Holly says, hey, check this one out. It's the Victor Tin Cat. And I'm gonna, let me turn this around. I'm gonna show you what it's all about. So it's a, it's a metal box and I know it's out on Amazon too. Metal box, it's about, there's an opening at both ends there's ventilation this is a humane trap there's an opening on both sides um, but there's ventilation otherwise it's metal hinge good good hinge on the side uh, riveted hinge it opens up and sorry just got it it's uh, you can see where the mice come in the door and they come in the entryway here and I'll put uh, put some food right there for them. They can't get back out. It's a one-way door. And then they're trapped in there. In the morning, I can uh, take them out. Um, they say, let me spin you around here. The, the instructions say, you know, you can humanely release them. Uh, I think they said two miles from your house. Okay. The first day, I thought, there's no way I caught any. I opened the thing just slightly and about five jumped out. Uh, one on my arm, scared the heck out of me. So I shut the door quick and then I brought it out in the middle of the yard. I whistled up the girls and opened up the lid again and another four jumped out and the girls went nuts chasing them. And unfortunately, well, fortunately for us, there were no survivors. Um, the girls, enjoyed some protein really quick. Well, I thought, I'm not giving them mice every day. Um, put the trap up. So uh, I, I then picked some more up that day, uh, two days ago. I got a total of 10 mice that first day. Put it out last night. Again, little peanut butter. Um, this morning, six mice. I just, I was heading into town, brought the trap with me, uh, brought it out on an old dirt road out in the middle of nowhere farm country open it up and six jumped out so uh two days 16 mice i thought you know what uh, this is a winner i'm going to take you along for the ride on this so i'm going to show you it's got a little little bit of straw in there little droppings i tried to clean it up i'm just taking some peanut butter and i'm gonna let me see if i can hold the camera and do this at the same time I'm just putting some peanut butter on the bottom of the trap. Simple as that. It's now baited. Sorry, got to wipe my hand off here. Get that off and be done. Okay, the trap is baited. We're set. Walk with me here. Tonight's one of those nights where we had yet another storm form almost completely over us. You know, we have yet to have significant rain this summer, but it decides to form right by us. I'm gonna spin you around and show you. Hopefully you can see it. Holly's out watering, but look at the, let me see if I can point it the right direction. Look at that, that line of storms. Just monstrous storms, just to our south and to our east. Unreal. So, our life. 
anyways, um, this trap, I'm gonna put a link down below. You can get it out on Amazon, $9.99. This thing you can clean. Um, it is, uh, it's a winner, it's a winner. You can clean it easily, you can bait it easily, you can drop off the mice or, you know, get them out to your hens if you wanna feed some protein real easy. It's just easy to use. Let me uh, walk in here. I've got this fence. I got a fence that uh, divides kind of an area here where I've got fencing and supplies and stuff back here. So the, the hens can't get here. I'm just putting it right there. Just nestling it. Nestling it in real nice along where the door is going to shut. Now let me shut the door. There's my trap for the night, and the mice will be running around there and in no time. Here's what I'm going to do. Um, if you're already interested, check out the link on Amazon down in the description and buy one. I know you'll be happy. If not, and you want proof, I'm going to film in the morning. Uh, I'm going to come out here and uh, grab the trap, and then I'll take it out in the country and uh, open it up and uh, you can see the results. So stay tuned for the results of what I think is one of the best mouse traps I've ever used in my life. So we'll be right back tomorrow morning. Well, good morning, everybody. I'm out in the barn. Let's go see what we've, uh, what we've got here. Just gotta pick it up and bring it outside here. Shut my door here. And let me take a look through the, well, it's hard to, hard to show. There are, I'm looking through the little slats here. I don't know. Let me, uh, let me get us uh, out to uh, my drop off spot. There's at least two in there. So uh, we've got success, but let me show you um, how easy it is to release them. I'll be right back. Hey everybody, well, the grand reveal. I'm uh, out, out in the country, out in the country. I thought uh, I'm gonna let these ones go and uh, we'll see what this can do. It's the Victory Victory Tin Cat. I'll put a, put a link down below, but let me show you the, the release. So it's just a matter of uh, opening up the lid. And there's one, two, Hopefully you saw them. There goes, there goes number three. Three of them popping off down the road. And it doesn't look like there's... Oh, there is another one in there. There's two in there. There we go. Get out of there. And there's one more in there. Get out of there, buddy. Get out. Anybody else in there? Well, let me spin this around and we can be done. Um, that was more than I thought. Five, the Victory Tin Cat. I will put a link down below. If you're trying to get rid of mice in your, in your barn, in your coop, uh, you know, obviously the girls can't get into this trap, um, but the mice sure can. Five. So that is, what did I have? I think I'm at, uh, I had 16, that's 21 in three days. And this was only out for not even 12 hours. So it holds 30 mice, is what they say. And seeing the five mice popped out of there, um, it will hold 30. <laughs> I would get, well, I'm gonna get another one. I, I wanna just absolutely obliterate all the mice that are in our, uh, in our coop. So the Victory Tin Cat, get one uh, if you're serious about getting rid of your mice. So thanks for, uh, for following me around out to the country road for the uh, mouse release. I'll uh, put all the links down below, everybody. Take care, thanks for watching the product review, bye.